Hello, beautiful people. My name is Cheryl. I'm happy to see you today. I have had a time trying to get this video started. I was I had a sneezing fit. The train came by when it was blowing the whistle. The dogs were barking. My husband called. It's like I, I'm I stop. Just just let it be, right? Let it be. I've got my let it be t-shirt on and I'm not supposed to be aggravated right now. So um, let me go ahead and tell you what I've got on. I've got my Let It Be t-shirt from Timu. I've got my earrings, my turquoise earrings, which matches my ring perfectly. Look at that. This was two separate orders. It was just a, just, I saw the, I got the ring first, then I saw the earrings and I went, oh my gosh, it's perfect. So they match wonderfully. So, and then I've got my green cat eye nails on, which I adore. <laughs> They're so much fun. I love these. I hope he likes them too. He's like that. Those those nails could lead a man somewhere. And I said, stop. <laughs> he acts like he's he acts like we're both 14, 15 sometimes. Maybe 18. Let's let's at least do consenting age, right? So anyway, I have got a huge, huge haul for you today to share with you. So get yourself something to drink, a snack. It's gonna be a bumpy ride, y'all. And if you're new to my channel, welcome, and if you're returning, welcome back. Happy to have you. So, hit the prices will be here. Everything that I share, share with you will be linked below, and we'll get started. So, because we're going to be here a while. So, I found some more Halloween things, and I wanted to share those with you first, because I need to get this out of the way. I'm knocking stuff over, and, and it's just... So, this is a set of pajamas that I found, and... <laughs> I got them extra big, but this is the shirt, and it is, you know, the uh, the polyester, which is kind of heavy, so that's going to be perfect for the time of year that I'm going to be wearing it. So that's the shirt, and then the pants, the well, it's shorts, are these. So they're really cute. They've got spider webs and bats and pumpkins on them so this is the same same kind of material like i said i got them big so that i'd be comfortable in them but this is going to be a lot of fun to wear for halloween season so i'm looking forward to wearing some some awesome things i also found a couple pair of leggings that are for halloween these are wild these are wild and crazy y'all they have pumpkins and ghosts and, and skulls and says boo. They're a lot of fun. They're just a lot of fun. I like the fun and whimsical side of Halloween. I don't like the gory, scary side. So, yeah. But these are these are really cool. They're that same material, that silky kind of, kind of thing. And I got these big two. And then another pair of leggings that I found are these. Now these are a little more calm. <laughs> these just have jack-o'-lanterns with their little faces lit up. It's a little different feel to these, but they're still kind of silky. So I think they're gonna be they're gonna be very comfortable to wear. So and, and I don't wear these out, y'all. I wear them all out on the porch to get the dog bowl so I can feed her. But that's about as far as in public I'll wear those. Now, I found this shirt. Now, I will wear this one in public. This is adorable. Look what it says. It says, Hippie Halloween. And it's pink. Is that not the cutest thing? Oh, my gosh. It's so cute. He's saying peace, y'all. It's these fingers. Peace. Peace out. Look, <laughs> I love it. And I also found the perfect earrings to go with Go with this. Look, look, they're like blue and pink. They change colors and then they've got hippie flowers. Oh my gosh. You know, I know when this is coming out because this is past Cheryl. Present Cheryl is camping. So she is off grid. So if you comment which i hope you will to this video and she doesn't respond then let her um give her give her a little time because she she's going to be going back and forth into service area so she will she she told me she would comment as soon as she could i'm being silly because you know but i will i'll comment as soon as i can and while we're on that subject um if you could if you if it wouldn't trouble you too much uh, for you to like this video we would really appreciate it my husband and i 
getting ready to take this channel to the next level. So we would love um, for you to interact with us and, and help us grow our channel. So that being said, back to this. But isn't this cute? Little pink. Uh, I can't. She's got a little pink flower. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Too cute. And I think one more Halloween. One more. Yeah, one more Halloween. I couldn't resist this one, and you'll know why. <laughs> Old school. You'll know why. Now this one's a, that little scratchy um, polyester, and you know I do wash everything before I wear it, and they do wash up well. And I always turn my shirts inside out if they've got the vinyl, um, you know. Uh, transfers on them. I wash them inside out, but they do wash up like a dream. I've not, I've not had any, any problems with any of them. But yeah, this is really cute. So, good Halloween stuff. I also found this one, and I wish I had gotten a different color, because the, the part of the design is not showing up on the white, but this is it. And I don't know if you can see it. It says Criminal Minds Behavioral Analysis Unit. Isn't that cool? And I think it would have shown up better on the gray, maybe the gray option. But I still like it. I, I really like it. And it's, um, you know, Criminal Minds is, is um, I love forensic files and uh, cold case files and, and all those shows like that. I, 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 you know, I love those shows, Dateline and, and, um, Snapped, you know, those kind of shows. This one gets to me. Th this one actually disturbs me. So I can't watch this one if I'm home by myself. I can't because this, this one is, a little more than I can handle, <laughs> you know, but I do love the show. It's just, I, I don't watch it when I'm home by myself because, you know, yeah, it's, it's, uh, and, and if you know, you know, you know, you know what I'm saying, you know, you know, you know. I also got this one. Now this one they had marked down to like $3 and something, and I've already got a black one, but they marked this one down and I went ahead and picked it up. I wear my black one all the time. I love this. They do have made in the 70s, made in the 80s, and I think they have one that says made in the 90s. So, and I also picked up another one for my sister because I got her a black one too, but this one, I got my my other, my young, my baby sister made in the 70s because she's a couple years um, into the 70s. So, that is the clothing items that I got. Very happy with everything. Now I can get everything washed and, and put in the drawers and put away. So I'm, ha I'm happy about that. Okay. What first? What first? Let's, let's do a little bit of jewelry. Then we'll bounce, we'll just bounce back and forth. So maybe a couple accessories first. I found these headbands that I really, really like. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Now this was this is one of those things from Timu that was bigger than I thought it would be. I thought that this flower part would be smaller, but it's uh, it's still very very pretty, and it's very pretty on. So, and then I also found this one, which it it is smaller. I really like it. And the sets are just sparkly, you know, they're in silver, and they're just, they're just very feminine, you know. If you just want a little bling in your hair, really pretty little bow. And then I also found this gold one that's just plain, but it's just got a set, and then some gold, then a set, then some gold all the way around it. So it's very, very pretty. And they all have this little stopper little, little ball here and these actually don't hurt my head the one I have in my hair doesn't hurt my head and these don't um, some of the ones that I've gotten from Timu do hurt my head and, and I've always struggled with that you know to, to some extent I'll show you some couple pair of earrings that I have here the I've got the card upside down these are green and white enamel 
little hearts, and they're really pretty. They're separated. You know, they're so. Uh, one sits behind the other, and they're just opposite. And for some reason, that doesn't bother me. You know, I, I don't mind that at all. My school colors were green and white, so my high school colors. So, uh, I, you know, it's pretty partial to these, so they're cute. I like them. Also, these, which would go well with the shirt and the ring that I'm wearing. These. Now, these are really pretty. And these are, they're, they're stone. They feel, you know, they're thick. See? They're thick and they're, they feel like stone. So, they are very, very pretty. I love these. These were a little bit more expensive. But the colors are just beautiful. forgot these Halloween ones, but I'll show you these now. These are cute, but they're just little bats in a moon. Now, they would go with a number of my little Halloween t-shirts, but they're really cute. Little bats. They're enamel, too. The backing is just a gold. Isn't that cute? But these are really pretty. They're blue and orange, and they have this, uh, it's just like a mandala. It's got a design in the middle, and then this same color flower on the top. They're really, really pretty. Love these. I got some sunglasses. So these are just red sunglasses, and they've got the place where you can put those eyeglass holders on it if you so choose, but I like that they're... They're just really big. I like them. Yep. Cute. And y'all, get this. These are sunglasses that have bifocals in them. They are sunglasses, but they're reading glasses. Oh, somebody somewhere thought that up and how awesome is that these have you can i don't know if you can see the bifocals in them you might be able to i'm not sure what you can see i never am but there's bifocals these are 3.5 which is what i have to have but yeah they they have the bifocals right here so i can read and i can look up and i'm protected the sun from the sun i can read outside now without having to wear two pair of glasses. <laughs> so these are so awesome. These are so awesome. Who'd have thought, you know? You think that's cool? What about these? What about these? They come in this little box. Game changer. Game changer. Let me tell you. Look at these. Wait, get them out of the package. Look, <laughs> look at these, I'm so excited. Okay, all right, ladies, picture it. Sicily, 19, no, picture it. You're putting your mascara on. You can't see what you're doing, right? <laughs> you because you got one eye open and, one, and you're trying to get this up. Look here, look here. So you look through here to put this mascara on or your eye, eye shadow and then when you're ready to move you scooch it over look out this one and do this eye look at this is this not the this is a life changer for me it is absolutely life changing look at this I can't look you know, if I used regular thumbnails, that would be a thumbnail there, wouldn't it? That is, that is, they're just phenomenal. They're phenomenal. I can see what I'm doing in the mirror. Honestly. It, mm, my husband said, ooh, I could use those when I shave. And because and, he has the same problem. He, I notice, you know, he leaves patches and, uh, I said, well, I'm going to get you a pair because you ain't messing with mine. 
he, he'll take them outside or he'll take them somewhere else. He'll have an idea to use them for something else. And then, the, uh, where are my glasses? Well, I ain't had them. No, we're not doing that. These, these are mine and they're staying in the bathroom. Aren't these cool? I hope that that was a new thing for you. And I hope you're, you're just like, pause the video, add to cart, right? Yeah, I, I was, I mean, I was just, okay. So let's get into some random stuff here. I got this little doodad to go on one of my purses. It's a little paw print. Look how, look how sweet. It's rabbit, faux rabbit fur. Isn't that cute? They have different colors of these too. Really cute. And the ring opens somehow. Oh, it's one of those. It just goes like this. But you just clip it on. That's cute. So soft. These are really pretty nails. They're like a blue. Um, I think it said seaside or something. Seaside. Sea blue fashioned. Yeah, nails. Look how pretty. They do look beachy, don't they? All right, now, some different things. If you didn't know, Timu has these vacuum bags. They're like the space bags from back in the day. These are wonderful. These are absolutely wonderful. You don't need a vacuum cleaner now. They are, they've made them to where you just squeeze the air out of them and turn the knob and it'll, the air will stay out. But they have um, several different sizes. I got, and this is a two pack of small and a two pack of medium. And I've already purchased these once and I've put our, um, some of our clothing that we don't wear, you know, off season clothing, a couple blankets cause it's the middle of summer, you know. Um, and then, um, our summer clothes will go in these when it's time to switch those out. But these are really nice. And like I said, let me let me get one open and show it real quick. Oh, they come in. This little knob, you turn this, and it's like a Ziploc bag. The little zip zipper things right here. You put your things in it, zip it up. You turn this to open it, push all the air out, then turn this to seal it. And, and it, it's, it stays vacuumed. So they're really nice and they're very inexpensive. I'll put that back away later. I wanted a new coffee scoop and I overbought the size because I was afraid it would be too small. Because you know how Timu is, you know, you, you get things that you think are one size. and they're... So I ordered a 30 milliliter and it turns out that's two tablespoons, which is too big. But this, this thing is so heavy. This thing is so heavy. It is heavy duty scoop. So if you need a good stainless steel scoop, this is this is the one for you. It, this is two tablespoons. I'm gonna have to go back and order the smaller one, but it's it's like fit for your thumb, you know, to where your thumb fits in there, and it's just it's just fabulous. So I'll get a smaller one, but this is handy to have. It's two tablespoons. All right. Staying in the kitchen for a second, I found this. This is a tea infuser. Can you stand it? It's a little umbrella tea infuser. You take, it's got the little stand and the drip, you know, the drip pan. And then you pull the silicone top out. You put your tea down in there and put the top back on very carefully because I've already, I, I don't know if you can see that. I've got a, a place right there I push this down and these are not these are sharp these are sharp right here so you have to be very careful and then you drop this down in your cup of hot water and it will infuse your tea and then when you take it out it's got the little stand so it can drip and too cute I think they have different I think they have different tops because the little tip of the umbrella and the handle is green on this one, and I think they have different colors of these. Isn't that cute, though? That's adorable. Absolutely adorable. This is an, <clears throat> an ice mold. This is really different. I like this look. 
Look at that. It makes triangle shape ice. You just put your water down in there, push this down in there and seal it. And then your ice freezes into triangles. And then when your ice comes out, you just take it and pop it and it comes right out. That is so cool. It doesn't take up hardly any room in your freezer. You put four or five of these, right, slide them right in your freezer and you've got ice for days. You know, cute, cute, such clever people. And these are also ice molds. Look how cute these are. These make big balls of ice. These would be perfect for mixed drinks or, you know, dropping down, drop one of them in an iced tea or, you know, they come in a set of four. So there's four colors, pink, blue, purple, and yellow. Isn't that, aren't they neat? I love these. I can't wait to use them. I'm going to wash them and get them in the freezer. But they are so cute. So you would pour the water in here. Unscrew the top. Put the water in there when it's intact. Screw it back. There is a fill line on each one. There is a fill line. Then when it's ready, you might have to run it under a little water or not. I don't know. But you just pull the little silicone ball off and, and your ice comes out. Can you stand it? Too cute. I love these. These don't take any room. You put these in the door of your freezer. Make you some, some ice that way. Yeah, I'm fascinated with these different ice molds. I'm fascinated with them. This is another option for your fruit flies. You can take a water bottle, put this. This is the same concept as taking a bottle, cutting it in half, turning the top over, and look at that burn, y'all. It's getting better, but goodness. That's, that's what I did. One of them's shaped like a, like you can see where the grease hit and then run down. Yeah, it's crazy. But anyway, you put the, um, you know, you would split a water bottle, take the top, turn it over, put it down in there and make a funnel and then put your vinegar. Well, these, you don't have to do that. You can just stick it down in a water bottle. And it's, it's the same concept. They go down in there, then they can't find their way back out. So this, this is nice to have. You know, if you want that, bottle sitting out on your counter, which it doesn't bother me if I'm not expecting any company, you know, but I, I like the little tomato pumpkin things if, if uh, you know, if I'm expecting company. They just look a little, little better than, than a water bottle with dead fruit flies in it, but, you know, but these, these are, these are another option, you know, if it's, if you, if you don't care to have a water bottle sitting out on your counter, and you know, you can hide it behind something, it doesn't matter. Then I got this. This is a crafting thing, but this is so cool. This is a flexible ruler. Look at this. Okay. So if if you um, use a bullet journal or you you know you make your own like you, you know you doodle or anything in your notebooks or your planners or anything like that or you, you need these are awesome. They showed the example. You could make them into an S. And then trace around it and make a make a squiggly line. You can put it into a circle and make a circle, you know, around something that you want to put, you know, just just draw around it. This this is really neat. It just it just goes any old way. You can just bend it whichever way, and then you can trace it, draw the line wherever you need it to go. And it's also got the measurements on it. It's got inches and it's got uh, centimeters, millimeters. Now, how cool is that? That is just really, really cool. I bought this for a gift, and it's not exactly what I was hoping it would be, but it's cool nonetheless. And I'm not gonna, well, I did open it. I, that's right, I did. They're plastic, but they're still cute. So, look, look at what it is. Isn't that cute? And it comes with a tray. But these are little bowls. You could use these for condiments. You could put pickles, olives, and like tomatoes in them, you know, really cute. And then when you turn them over, you know, they store like, like that. Control, alt, delete. Oh, and the tray has a little circuit board on it. These are really cute. 
and they can leave them sitting on the counter and it's just a, a nice con conversation piece. Now that you're awake, <laughs> let me get this back and back over here out of the way before I break it. Check this out. Now they have the silicone lids for your bowls, and I'm a I'm a I'm a big big fan of those. I love those. Love 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 those. Highly recommend them. I saw this and I went, no way. So let me show you this thing. It's silicone silicone lids, same concept, right? But it goes over a bowl and you can pop popcorn and put the butter, the pats of butter in here and it'll melt on the popcorn as it's popping. Stop it. Is that not the neatest thing? Let me show you. Let me see. Set the pop lid over the microwave safe bowl. Place butter flavoring in the built-in butter vents. Butter melts as your popcorn pops. Microwave on high for three to five minutes. Remove bowl when there are two seconds between each pop. Only use butter vents that are that sit directly over popcorn. So you don't want it going, you want to make sure your bowl size is right. You don't want it dripping down the sides of the bowl. Bowl and pop lid will be hot and may have hot oil on them. Always use oven mitts. So that's complete instructions. It's a popcorn silicone microwave lid. That is the neatest thing. That is the neatest thing. All right, get you one, get you one. So I think that's it. So if you stuck around till the end of the video, put popcorn in your comment. We'll do that. Put popcorn in your comment, and I'll know that you stuck it out with me, and I appreciate you so much. Be sure and stay tuned. Subscribe if you've not subscribed. We appreciate every one of you. Hit that like button, and we will see you very soon. And until then, happy shopping. <music>